Hey y'all, welcome to another studio vlog. My name is Erica with Erica Home Company. I'm excited to have you all here again with another video. Today we are going to make some stickers and get them prepared for shipping for my shop. Also, we are going to work on um, some new stickers that we're bringing to the shop. Today, the focus is on stickers. We also got some new things. I'm gonna show you some new things we got in the mail today and take it from there excited i got an etsy order i have not had an etsy order in a while so it was kind of cool to get it so this etsy order is going to be for um, our cloud sticker so we're going to be creating the cloud sticker i actually printed it already so right now we are working on getting it cut with the cricut so i'm going to get that going and we're just going to show you how we get everything ready for shipping Okay, so this is why I'm so over sometimes using Cricut. <laughs> okay, and this is some of the things that we deal with. And you probably saw it in my last video. Um, irritating. We have one printed here. This is super cute. Let me show you what it looks like and kind of get you out of the light. So this is our cloud sticker. This is one of our purchases from our Etsy shop. So we are going to ship this one out. And then we're also going to give a freebie sticker. And today I just kind of pulled from the collection. This is our newest sticker that I have. And I think it's so cute. I'm just going to add this to it. This is our take it easy sticker. Um, I just love the sticker because it just reminds you like life is lifing. That's what my sister says. Life is lifing, honey. So there is times where you just need to just relax and kind of just think about, you know, your well-being and just take it easy. So this is a really cute sticker. I'm going to be adding that as a, part, a gift with purchase um, for the stickers. So we are going to get this shipped out to our friend uh, for our Etsy order. Super excited about that one. And of course, in every order, we're going to add um, our thank you card that will be shipped out with this. So I don't know how everyone else ships out their stickers, but... I found these inspired mellers through Amazon and I think it's so cute. So it came in a pack of, excuse me, it came in a pack of 25 and it's six by eight. It's a really good size. It comes in white, pink, blue, and like the regular cardboard stock. I decided to get this like pinkish purple one because I just think it's just really, really cute. So um, it's very, it's very handy. It has um, a lot of room and space in here for my stickers as well as my card can actually fit in here because sometimes my cards can't fit in. So I'm going to put a little bit of uh, wrap in there, bubble wrap, and make sure everything is prepared for shipping so it ships uh, in a safe manner for our order. Another thing I like to do for my orders is making sure that we have like a back card to put our stickers on before we get them shipped. So we need to create that. We need to kind of make something for shipping. I like to go on my favorite website where I like to create different projects and that's through Canva. We want to create cardstock that has information on our stickers so we could get it prepared for shipping. So let's do that. The name of my company and it says sticker and it's the uh, company website so something pretty simple i didn't want to do anything too crazy because the sticker is going to plop in there and it's going to look like this first are going to be on there like that it's going to be cute i do not have a cutter yet for my paper i'm going to do it through cricut design space we're going to try this again and I'm going to use the paper. So I'm gonna print the paper, it's already in a printer, and we're gonna put it through the Cricut and see if it cuts right, okay? Look at it. Let me get the, uh, the light. So, let's turn it here. So look at it, it's so cool. It just says, 
the name of my company, sticker, the name of my website, and then what we'll do is we'll get it cut and then we're gonna take it right in here and then we're gonna put the sticker on it with it. It's gonna be so cute. Okay, y'all, now this has to work. It's working, I already see it's working. There we go. Oh, so cool. Okay, so I'm gonna peel this off. So, of course, Cricut never gives me like really defined lines. So, as you can see, like, this is not as perfect as I want it. <sighs> Cricut, Cricut, Cricut. So I'm just gonna make it a little bit more perfect. And voila, so cool. So you can do all of this at home. If you have time to do what I'm doing, like here's another one, like gotta love it. The things a business owner that no one sees, no one knows about. Does anyone care? I don't know if they care about the rounding, but I think it's just looks so much cut here because it is not cut right. So I'm just going to show you all over here what it looks like. So again, this is like the pink cardstock I got from Michaels. And I did like a pink header with the name of my company. And it just says sticker. And I would say stickers, but I'm not putting more than one on here. And my website. So now is our cute little background for our sticker. And um, again, I got this from Amazon. It's just um, a double-sided tape. So what we're gonna do is in the middle here, we're gonna put some double-sided tape. If it wants to work, here we go. Perfect. And we're just gonna stick this right in the middle. Like this. Like this. How cute. Hi. I love it, it's so adorable. Okay, let's do the same thing with this one. Uh, put my take it easy, put it right there. And then we're all set. How cute is that? Super adorable. And this is done, again, I did it through Canva. Um, I use the paper stock from Michaels. The paper stock comes in a set where you can just get a whole bunch of multiple colors. If you do dark here, dark color, you don't want to make this dark. So I made this dark on Canva. And um, I just kind of played around with the colors and I really like how it came out. So cool. So now what we're going to do, I got these cellophane. I always say it wrong. I got these papers. I actually got this from the dollar store. There are some great things you can find at the dollar store. If you want me to do a dollar store business haul, I can try to do so. Um, I got this again from the dollar store. And um, I'm just gonna place it in here and um, we should be good to go. As you can see, it's a little bit, I made it a little too small, but it's fine. It's cute still. Just, I'd rather have a smaller than too big, because then we have to worry about reprinting. Great. How cute is that? Okay. 
all done. And so now we're gonna get these ready for shipment. Again, these are um, from a sale that I got through Etsy. Right now, Etsy is offering free shipping. So if you're interested in some stickers, keep like this. Just let me know. And then take a look, super cute. So let's open up and see what's in here. Need some scissors. one of those cutters that they have um all on tiktok i need to do it and just buy it Let's see what we have oh my gosh you guys they're here it's the bamboo lids how cute okay let's open them up and see how they look yeah. I think it looks small. I don't know, it looks small, you guys. I'm worried. Let's see how worried I am. I'm worried, you guys. Let's see how worried I am. Oh, it's not bad. It's not bad. Let's see if it fits in one of the cups. Here we go. We're gonna do it. I'm gonna see if it works. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Yeah. In love, like in love. I know I was just selling cups and I just, I felt like it was just something missing that just made it look just like so brilliant. Okay, hold on, we're gonna check out another one. Hold on, let's see how it looks. Oh my gosh! Yeah! Like, super cute. So these are, again, these are the 16 ounce cups that I made. I love this cup. This one is my Candy Corn Witch Cup. In this cup right here is my pink cloud cup they are so adorable and probably one of my favorite ones in my collection right now um, I did not order a lot of um, the prints for this one so when it's gone it's gone so yeah it's super cute okay that was one thing that came and then let's see what else is in here So we got some glass straws to go in our cup, which is gonna just put the icing on the cake with the cups. So I'm going to unbox these here. And here are the glass straws, curved straw. And then we also have straight straws. So I'm adding both of these to the website and they're just glass, clear, straight straws and curved straw. And I'm gonna show you what it looks like in the cup. So there they go. Super cute. I just really like this whole look. Um, some people use it without a lid, but this available, going to be available in the store soon. Again, the glass straws will be sold separately. Lids will be sold separately, just so you can kind of pick your interest and in what you like. You may not like you know, any lid at all, but you want a straw, but I'll give you the option that you could choose from either one. So yeah, this is the completion of the video today. I'm so glad that you all were here to join and make sure you follow, share, and subscribe. And I hope to have you along for the next video. Bye.